Good morning and welcome to Heartland Dual Sport. This morning we're going to be going up and meeting with Misty, which is hot girl here on YouTube, and her husband Jay, and they're going to kind of show me around some areas in their neck of the woods. So let's go ride. As many of you know, we've experienced a multitude of problems. We switched our, we switched from having a wired mic going straight to the GoPro to the Cena audio back. So this part of the video, we actually have nothing. I've had, uh, I had some issues with it when I went and rode up with Frank. I had pre-tested the audio back with me and Angie here in the house, and uh, again. This is another failure for the Cena audio back. As you can see, we're riding along here, and you can listen to this. Yeah, absolutely nothing. So, uh, in short, I'm not extremely pleased with the Cena audio back. I'll uh, end up doing a full review on that later on, but right now I'm trying to, you know, just kind of prep for the ride. And right now we're on our way to meet up with hot girl and Jay we contacted them prior to our vacation to going out out east and I had plans of meeting up with hot girl as well as the steel horseman and during the trip we were we were fortunate enough that we actually got to meet up with hot girl this uh, video right here is basically just kind of showing you the uh, trip up to the town and I'm trying to think of the name of the town that I met them at <laughs> as you know I'm terrible with names Maggie Valley luckily my wife's got a great memory but uh, Maggie Valley is where we ended up meeting Hawk Girl and Jay long story short I got up they that that is about an I think it was about a two-hour trip from from where we were actually camped at so I got up early and I plugged in the GPS or um, actually on my cell phone the uh, Maggie Valley the name of the town and proceeded to ride that way using my Cena headset which I truly love and I mean I absolutely would not trade it for anything even though the Cena audio back doesn't work too good the actual headset itself is the bomb and I mean it's it's worth its weight in gold I couldn't brag on it enough but anyhow so I've got uh, Maggie Valley typed into my GPS on my on my iPhone, and my iPhone is giving me the directions how to get there. And while I'm on my way there, which, like I say, it's about a two-hour ride, I've been riding for I don't know maybe an hour and a half, and I get to looking at my phone, and it's showing that it's showing that the actual town is, of Maggieville is still like an hour away and I and I can't figure out why when I started out it was an hour and a half and now it's, <laughs> it's showing on on my phone that I've still got like an hour or so to go so I'm I'm on my way there and I'm actually kind of starting to panic at this point and I'm thinking oh my gosh I've obviously taken the wrong turn because there was a couple of times when I'm driving there that, you know, Siri would say something to the effect of remain on course, remain on course, or, or something like that. And I'm thinking, I haven't even done anything. <laughs> I haven't even done anything. But anyhow, I think Siri is actually having a great time messing with me. It's kind of like, you know, the, the commercials messing with Sasquatch or whatever, but uh, it, it ended up it actually ended up being funny but I mean at the time I'm starting to panic a little and I'm thinking oh my goodness you know I'm I'm gonna have to call Misty and tell her that I am so goofy that I can't find this town <laughs> and I would be I would be terribly terribly upset if if they you know spent their morning trying to get there as well and and then you've got this uh, flatlander from the heartland the state of oklahoma that uh obviously can't follow a map but anyhow it, it all it all ended well um siri i think just got a kick out of it i'm sure i could hear her giggling in the background but uh towards the after about an hour or so we 
I, I ended up finding them. We met up at the gas station there in town that she'd given me the address to. And uh, as you can see, we're fixing, to, we're fixing to meet up with her and Jay right now. And they're around here in the video. You're going to see they're right here in front of us. We're going to uh, actually take I-40. And this is the craziest thing I've ever seen. But we're on I-40. If I, and, and correct me if I'm wrong, Misty. But we're on I-40. And we're headed outside of Maggieville, and I'm, I'm I'm not too sure. I'm gonna go with West, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> I honestly don't know. But anyhow, we're heading <laughs> we're heading out of town, and in the middle of nowhere. And I am you know here in Oklahoma, if there's a road to get off, there's an exit ramp. But this is there's no exit ramp to this road. You're just going along at 65 miles an hour you got to slam on your brakes and then there's this goat path that goes up through the woods that will be the next video i appreciate each and every one of you tuning into heartland dual sport we're going to continue this in another video because i don't want this to be too long but i did kind of want to i i wanted to share this story with you i thought it was actually pretty comical and funny ended up meeting with misty and jay it was a great time but uh We've got some awesome videos coming up. I think I've got two or three more videos where I'm riding with Jay and Misty for the entire day. And mostly this video is, you know, kind of tell you the story, how we, how we ended up meeting up, tell you the little, you know, follies of actually ending up finding them. And, and the most important thing is, guys, I'm truly grateful that they set some time aside to meet with me and show me around this beautiful state they live in. Me and my wife, we, we absolutely love this area. And if there's any way we could retire here, that's that's where I plan to go. I mean, it's just so awesome in and around here. But uh, again, a big thank you to Hot Girl and Jay and Misty. And if you like our video, give us a big thumbs up. If you know anybody that's uh, thinking about getting into the dual sport stuff, share our videos with them. We, we'd encourage each and every one of you to share our videos and most of all, we want you all to have a blessed week.